You know, parents are always looking to find a niche for their young athlete, a sport that fits their talent and temperament. Well, if your daughter hasn't quite found what she's looking for, there's a sport that's been around since the 1600s that's finally taking hold in the Midwest, lacrosse. The sport has taken off with a number of school-based teams, school-based clubs, and club teams like ours on the Kansas side. Um, on the Missouri side, obviously, there's more teams. Um, even all the way over to St. Louis. Cross's shiny mission team, the defending Metro champ, and Notre Dame Day Sion, the 2014 champ, squared off Wednesday night on Sion's brand new field, with shiny mission winning a nail biter. But the bottom line isn't the score, it's the sport and how it's finally caught on here in the Midwest. So there's so many opportunities for girls to play beyond high school, which is awesome because I think these girls are starting to learn that this sport is a serious sport and it is a popular sport and it's a competitive sport that can be played at the next level. More and more of those opportunities are springing up all over the Midwest. Benedictine College and nearby Atchison took notice and quickly added scholarship women's lacrosse to its athletic family. Women's lacrosse is really exploding in the Midwest right now, and I think Benedictine wanted to get a jump on what they knew what was already going to become so much more popular in the next three to five years. McGee has been recruiting locally, and it hasn't taken long to attract talent. Its location has a lot to do with it. I definitely was looking to play for sure, and it was awesome that I could stay close to home so I could see my sister's games and so my family could come see me play. So.